Hello friends, welcome to Get Data Solution. Today we will see about RIFT function to assess student uh, grade report. Here is a student grade and here is the chart. So we will assess today using the RIFT function how we can actually do uh, the performance assessment. If you are actually new to this channel, this is the Get Data Solution that actually provides different tools for business people as well as for project management. The purpose of this channel, Get Data Solution, is to modernize data system, to save time, to generate automatic report, to reduce cost, to increase productivity, to manage project to manage business as well as to learn new skills so uh, if you are actually new to this channel please subscribe uh, to our channel here is the reason why you should actually subscribe to our channel if you subscribe to this channel you will uh, achieve the following the first one is it will help you to manage your business it will actually uh, help you to manage your project if you are actually uh, uh, working on the project if you are actually working on the business it will actually facilitate that one uh, it will actually help you to manage your work as well the other is it will automate your activity whatever the activity you are actually engaged in it will automate that for you it will also increase your productivity and you learn new skills as well as uh, make informed decisions so uh, if you are actually subscribed to our channel you will get uh, products that will actually help you to do all these uh, uh, benefits so please subscribe to get data solution to get uh, and benefit from those uh, benefits so coming to today's topic here is uh, student grade report for Matis and for English the first one is for Matis and the second one is for uh, English from this data uh, this uh, rift chart is actually created just by looking at this data in which subject student performance is good can we guess it just guess by looking at these figures so uh, at the end you will get the, the result and we'll show you that so once uh, we insert uh, the grade point for students this uh, raped child will create for us uh, the chart like this one proportional to its uh, number as you can see here so uh, we produce this using raft function if you actually want to produce raft function we can, you can follow this step for example in our case use raft function raft i uh, i used i in c9 which is this one Re repeat i that is c9 seven to eight times that's how i did it then after that i will drag for the remaining uh, columns then i uh, used font color yellow for this one again and the blue for the English then I used uh, I used conditional formatting if it is greater than 80 green color will be displayed here green color if it is less than 40 red color will be displayed this has been adjusted using the conditional formatting the same is true for English subject 
with the exception of uh, blue blue for between 40 and 80 so this is how it has been constructed if you actually want to construct the rift function for your data you can use these steps and here is also the instruction and the instruction you'll get here you will insert the grade report then it will automatically generate the chart so once we fill this data we will get this chart for matches and this for english then it will also uh, give us a summary above 80 we have used the cutoff point here 80 and 40 and the number of students who have actually scored greater than 80 are two here this is also indicated here by green color student number three and student number six have got green that is in confirmation with this value for english as well it is three here it must be here three yes one two three so it is in agreement with our data so uh less than 40 three here student two student 11 and student 12 here it is indicated in red similarly for english two students this and this so in summary uh, we have actually over 70% uh, of the students have actually scored above 80% above 80 and in general uh, if we actually take 40 is a cutoff point for pass about 75% have actually passed and about 25% has failed in in matches so for english similarly here about 83% have passed so for our in initial question which says in which subject student performance is good now we can actually uh, suggest uh, an answer for that question based on informed decision for much 75 percent of a pass point if we take 40 as a pass point but we can actually change on the actual circumstances of uh, that school regulation in english a three percent have pass uh, up a pass point so in each subject student performance is good obviously it is in english so which is about 80 percent have actually 83 percent have passed so uh, this rift function is used uh, and help us to make informed decision so let's insert a hypothetical data together and construct similarly uh, and this uh, this uh, rift using this rift function let's you look use 90 hypothetical data for students can you see it the first three student have green then yellow and then red <coughs> so uh, let's let again take this for English 80 75 yeah uh, in, in for the matches three students have scored above 80 which is and you see in indicated in green and only one student have actually scored less than 40 which is student number 12 in this particular case so it will give us a summary again 
so we at the end of the analysis we have to answer this question which says in which subject student performance is good based on our data we'll uh, try to answer that one uh, again for english we have inserted this data and we have got this only one student have above 80 which is the first student and then three students have scored uh, below 40 this student student 10 11 12 so it is in confirmation with our data three here the red is three uh, three green here's green three one green one green and so on so for the question earlier we have asked it uh, look 92 percent have actually passed in in matches and 75 percent passed in english 9275 so you can answer based on our data here this question matches 92 percent are passed english eight three is it eight three let's check it now 75 75 percent are passed according to this data so nine two in matches and 75 in english so a good performance is actually uh, in matches in this case so we can actually make informed decision this is actually helpful also to make uh, adjustment and to guide students for example uh, the teacher teachers can actually um, consult students based on this result for example uh, this student student number 12 will be the first to be consulted by his teacher and here these three students should be consulted for english so it, we can actually easily identify the student that we are going to consult based on this result well let's look again if the cutoff point is actually different here is a cutoff point we have used in this particular case 50 in the earlier case we have used 40 cutoff point now let's uh, use 50 and let's use again the same mark we copy and paste here can you see here can you look into this data so our cutoff point is now 50 and 80 so earlier we have three here in green and one red one green and three red with the same data if the cutoff point is changed here three green and three red here three green one red now three red okay let's check it green three here yeah three one two three uh, red here three uh, three for english as well one green here yes and five red yeah so for the question in which subject student performance is good let's look this one this is 75 percent are passed 58 75 
58 so we can confidently uh, put our data here 75 percent and 58 in English Fifty-eight percent and seventy-five percent for matches. So we can uh, make informed decision. As I've already said, this is actually useful to make informed decision using raft function, and this is uh, very important for. schools this is recommended for schools college teachers school directors and the school principals they can use this raft function to just make analysis on the students uh, performance and make informed decision whether they are actually to support their student or to coach their student so this raft function is uh, as i have seen it is benefit are here it's easy and convenient to enter the data simply we insert the grade report automatically update the chart automatically generate chart and the summary report it saves time to avoid manual calculation it's simple to view by subject we have seen by subject for example for maths and for english in this case convenient to share to director we can actually share the result to director support to follow up students let teacher to coach the students the teacher can simply go and uh, coach their students based on this finding easily so oh, it is very useful and recommendable for uh, these uh, school teachers and directors as well as school principals so in today's topic where we have seen the rift function to analyze to make analysis for student grade report at least we have actually mm, achieved some of the benefit we have earlier claimed this is it has saved time to generate the report automatic report is generated increase it increase our productivity because we will actually eliminate the manual work which is actually uh, take us a lot of time so we have actually uh, get at least some uh, purpose we have already mentioned here so if you like this video please subscribe and share this video to your colleagues and if you know the teacher if you have a colleague please share to the teachers in your circle so that they can actually benefit from this uh, function once again thank you very much and bye bye